So how are you, Karen? Very well. How are you today, Javier? Thank you very much. Karen Macaras, a product manager for Mercedes-Benz for the new uh, family of E-Class, like the largest family in Mercedes-Benz, right? That's right, yes. So how many variants are of this car? Fifteen models, including the E-Class sedan, the wagon, the coupe, the cabriolet. Yeah, let's gonna start driving a little bit. Here we're like riding the cabriolet, which is beautiful. Maybe we should open the, the top and enjoy like sure. this beautiful day here in outside Portland. Oregon and it's a, a really a fantastic day so the top of this car it's uh, automatic as you are, are seeing now and you can uh, operate it at what 25 miles an hour yes, right? Yes, yes low speeds. 15 variants and uh, so of uh, you have the sedan, the coupe, the cabriolet and the wagon. Yes that's right. So what are the other options in the car like uh, I mean I guess uh, gas and uh, diesel right? We have gas and diesel and we also have an E400 hybrid in the sedan range and the diesel is new for us for model year 14 it's the e250 blue tech so that's a dual stage turbo and the nice thing about the diesel engine is that it has tremendous horsepower and torque the torque is actually equivalent nearly to one of our v8 engines 369 pound feet of torque. that's like a, a four cylinder it is an inline diesel, four cylinder correct. which is it's also on the um, glk right yes that's right that's right. So we're really excited about having that in the lineup now for model year 14. That, in addition to the redesign, is just a tremendous model year for us. And it's not often that you see such major changes at the midpoint in a life cycle. Exactly, because this car, with the, the current generation, has been on the market what, for like about three years? Exactly, and it's been very, very successful for us. Yeah, so diesel, gas, hybrid, and then there's something else on the very top of the line, right? Oh, uh, the AMG, <laughs> yes, of course. And even you were in the keeping AMGs, that from us. Yeah. Right, we have Formatic now available on the AMG, so we've done a lot at the midlife cycle not only with the redesign but in terms of the engines as you mentioned so that diesel very important for us and now we have formatic on the diesel as well as a two-wheel drive available and the big news in the amgs is that formatic is standard on the amg model another great thing about this car i, I recently was uh, in toronto not not like so long ago like a month ago driving the new s class mm -hmm. and that car is full of technology yes. but all the technology the safety technology has come down to this level right that's the best news. All of the intelligent drive technologies actually make their debut in the E-Class. It's the exact same package that we will be offering on the S-Class in a few months when that car launches. But right now, the intelligent drive suite of technologies is available on the E-Class models for $2,800. So we're very, very excited about that. A lot of innovative technologies. We have over 30 systems, um, either new or significantly enhanced. Yeah, one of them is the Distratic. Uh, that debuted, I think, uh, in 2000, around that time. Mm -hmm. But now the new system, it uh, basically makes the car drive itself. I mean, almost there. I mean, it's, uh, <laughs> I mean, you still enjoy it. I mean, this car, we were driving here over the mountains here outside uh, Portland, and like, it, like the performance is amazing. I mean, like the grip on the road is like, the, the handling of everything is like a big convertible, but like, it, it handles perfectly. But the, with the strength plus, it's for a different kind of uh, driving, right? Like CD and stop and go kind of thing. Exactly, and we were just talking about that a little earlier this afternoon. One of the nice things about the Distronic system, which you just mentioned, is in stop-and-go traffic. I think a lot of us have a tendency to think of the Distronic system as something that we might use on long distances, long drives, but it's actually a very convenient technology for short distances and stop-and-go traffic. It is really a much less stressful way. The other technologies are the, uh, for uh, the pre-safe, uh, the lane assist, I mm -hmm. mean, like you said, like 30, 30 systems in total, right? Well, yes, the driver assistance package that we offer is a combination of the Distronic Plus system with the steering assist, which is new. In that package, we also have active lane keeping assist, active blind spot assist, we have brake assist, we have cross uh, traffic recognition, which is new for us. We have pedestrian recognition. It's really an embarrassment of riches now that we have in terms of innovative new technology. Yeah, yeah. and Mercedes-Benz is always on the, on the top of the line in technology and everything. Can you repeat again when are the, the diesels are coming in later, right? The diesels will be out in a few weeks. We have a September launch date. Everything else has been introduced already. The sedans and wagons were introduced in April of this year. The coupes and cabriolets we introduced in June and the AMG models earlier in August. So by the time we reach September, all 15 models of the E-Class family will be available in the marketplace. And the E-Class is, uh, I mean, I think that the, the, the bigger volume for Mercedes-Benz is the C-Class, right? And the, but the E-Class the e comes close, close behind. 
Well, the E-Class is a very, very large volume model for us. The E-Class actually represents about 25% of total Mercedes-Benz sales. So the sedan could do approximately 50,000 units a year, and then the coupe and cabriolet do about six and 7,000 units respectively. The wagon can do about 1,500 to 2,000 units a year. So it's a very important model range for us. It really is the cornerstone of the brand. Yeah, and the great thing is that like it's one every model for every need or every every taste, right? Exactly. As I think you saw earlier today, and hopefully you've been experiencing on the drive today. Yeah, it's as a well. fabulous car. So we're gonna keep enjoying driving here in this beautiful day in the convertible. And maybe we'll try the wagon. I saw the wagon on the road, it looks pretty cool. And you, you don't have competition in the wagon, by the way, right? There's nobody else. percent market share, there's nobody else in the market. That's so I right. think they're going to do very well with that one. I think so too. <laughs> Thank you very much, Karen. Thank you, Abby. I enjoyed the day.